hi in this video i am going to show you how to publish the server desktop to the end user so if you want to publish the server desktop to the end user the first thing we have to install the vmware horizon agent on the windows server so before installing the vmware horizon agent on the windows server we need to enable the rds server role on the particular servers once we enabled we need to add the user group into the remote desktop group on the particular servers once we add it then we can install the vmware horizon agent then we can register with the connection server so once it's registered then we can create the rds form already i have created the rds form with one windows server now we need to go to the desktop pool then click add so uh, my previous video i told you i did not add at that v center server here that's why it's not showing the automated desktop pool it's in grayed out state but we can see the manual desktop pool and rds desktop pool manual desktop pool in the sense like windows 7 windows 8 windows 10 RDS desktop full in the sense this is a server desktop so we need to select RDS desktop full then click next this is the display display name which which is visible on the end user site So from the end user end, it will show server iPhone desktop iPhone 2012. So this is a setting for the server desktop. Uh, I'm giving this is as a default setting. So we need to select the RDS form to use the server desktop. So as of now, we can see only one RDS form. With that RDS form, we have added only one server. So I'm selecting this. So this is setting, we can verify it. If you want to add the user now itself, we have to check this box. Otherwise, for later purpose, if you, if you are creating this uh, desktop pool, we can uncheck this because we are not going to assign any user to access this server desktop. But right now I'm going to give access to the end user to access this server desktop. So that's why I'm checking this box. Click finish. So now I'm going to add that user. I'm going to give access to the domain users. Click find. Select. Click OK. Now we have added the domain users to access the server desktop. Now we can go to just enter the password. See, now we can able to see server desktop 2012 which is published from the horizon console right now just try to launch this So now we are able to see this desktop, the user one, we want to see the connection state on the horizon console, go to here, monitoring sessions, so
can see just expand this one user one right now accessing server desktop 2012 with the blast protocol thank you